Thank you. Our team coverage continues now with another controversial question before City Council. Should there be new rules when it comes to those electric scooters downtown? Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Louis Tran joins us live in the studio to tell us how Council voted on that tonight. Louis. Yeah, the Council voted down the proposed rules. They took issue on a few things in the ordinance, including the age limit to ride. You've seen these before. A company called Vio operates e-scooters in the fort. You download the app and then you're ready to ride. To the regulations committee and... At Tuesday's city council meeting, city officials presented an ordinance that would have created new rules. Riders would have to be at least 18 years old. Only one person would be allowed per scooter. And you wouldn't be allowed to carry a pet while riding either. The administration worked with police to draft the list. The city brought this company here to test the system out. We want this to work. But in order for it to work, there has to be some agreement about how these are used. Some council members, including Russ Yale, were ready to sign off. It's crucial to protect uh, motorists and the, and the kids that are using these. Uh, and it's a miracle that we haven't had a death yet. So we've had a lot of injuries and we've had a lot of problems. But Yale's vote wasn't enough. With a 7-2 vote, the council voted the ordinance down. One of the main sticking points, the 18-year-old age limit. Councilman Tom Didier says it's too high. I myself don't have issues with 14, 15, 16 years old so long as they're doing the proper things uh, with the scooters themselves. Uh, what safety first? In fact, all of the council members agreed on that. They're concerned about safety, but they don't believe the ordinance that came before them was a clear enough solution. So what's next? City officials tell me it's back to the drawing board and they plan to work the city council to draft up a new ordinance. They hope that can be done in the next two months.